Elon Musk, batteries are the most important resource for electric cars. Two days ago Tesla CEO Elon Musk stated on Twitter that batteries are just as important for future transportation as oil is for current transport. This is a profound statement and what must be realized is that the battery is the most expensive component to an electric car. And that cost is going to decline over time as the technology improves. Jeremy Johnson reports from Torque News Tesla reporting team. Elon Musk stated that batteries are the most important component for an electric vehicle. Just as important as oil is for gas cars, in fact. With this statement, let's look at the top battery manufacturers, where they are located, and what the future of batteries for electric cars might be. The top battery manufacturers in the world are 1. Catla 32.5% 2. LG Energy Solution 21.5% 3. Panasonic 14.7% 4. BYD 6.9% 5. Samsung 5.4% 6. I wonder where Tesla ranks in this as we know Tesla is making many of their own batteries in addition to purchasing them from suppliers. Perhaps Tesla is in the other category mentioned. What's most interesting about the top battery suppliers in the world is that the top 10 are concentrated in China slash Asia. This tells me that the U. S. is falling asleep when it comes to battery production and only Tesla in the U. S. is really following the flow of change. Can the US catch up? Can the United States catch up in battery suppliers and manufacturers? Should the United States companies even try to produce their own batteries if manufacturers in China can do it cheaply? I think the answer is yes. Here's why. Tesla is making many of its own batteries and also buying them from suppliers. If I were an auto company or an energy company, or both, I would be investing in building my own batteries in addition to buying them from suppliers in China. The reason for this is very simple. The end of the internal combustion engine is coming. We are at the beginning of an exponential growth curve of adoption toward electric vehicles and renewable energy. Tesla may single-handedly keep the United States ahead technologically with its advancements in batteries and energy. Without Tesla, I worry that the United States would adopt a very slow rate of adoption to electric vehicles and far very behind the rest of the world, with most major automakers going out of business. With the cost of batteries continuing to go down and down, Tesla will eventually be able to produce its Model 2. Other cheaper versions of electric vehicles will come toward the end of the decade until it is blatantly obvious how much cheaper and effective electric vehicles are than their gas counterparts. What do you think of Elon Musk talking about batteries and they being the most important thing for an electric vehicle? Will we see Tesla or other United States manufacturers of batteries? In irrelevant battery news, Chinese electric vehicle battery giant Contemporary Amperex Technology Company CATL, has made investments in a pair of major overseas projects, including an acquisition of a Canadian lithium company and investment in a joint lithium project in the Democratic Republic of Congo DRC. CATL has agreed to purchase Canada's Millennial Lithium Corp for $376.8 million Canadian dollars, $297.3 million, Reuters reported on Wednesday, citing the Canadian mining company. Earlier this week, Australia's AVZ Minerals said that a firm jointly owned by CATL will invest $240 million to develop one of the world's largest lithium projects in the DRC. Sujo Cath Energy Technologies, a private investment entity jointly owned by CATL, will invest $240 million in cash to develop the Monono Lithium and Tin project with AVZ International Proprietary, a wholly owned subsidiary of AVZ Minerals, according to a statement issued by AVZ Minerals on Monday. CATH will receive a 24% equity interest in a multi-layer joint venture to develop the Monono project and contribute more than $400 million subject to final project development costs verification, while parties will assess the feasibility of developing a lithium hydroxide facility, for the statement. AVZ Mineral previously held a 75% stake, which will now drop to 51%, while Common Ear, a stated-owned company in the DRC, would retain its 25% interest. Monono is the largest and highest grade undeveloped hard rock lithium project in the world, according to AVZ Minerals. In March, AVZ Minerals singed the binding offtake agreement with Shenzhen Chengxin Lithium Group for the supply of spotomini concentrate, SC6, from the Monono project, AVZ Minerals said. While numerous governments and automakers have recently announced ambitious plans to transition to emission-free vehicles, many lack a clear roadmap to where these millions of batteries are going to come from. Countries are running out of time, and resources, to produce enough batteries to satisfy this new consumer demand. As a result, 
Everywhere from the deep sea to the shallow salt and sea is being plundered for minerals to prepare to find enough materials and accommodate for this shift in policies. Based in China's coastal city of Ningda, best known for its tea plantations, contemporary Amperex Technology Company Limited (CATL) has risen in less than 10 years to become the biggest global battery group. The Chinese company provides lithium iron phosphate (LFP) batteries to Tesla, Peugeot, Hyundai, Honda, BMW, Toyota. Volkswagen and Volvo and shares in the company gained 160% in 2020, lifting Cattle's market capitalization to almost 186 billion dollars. Cattle counts 9 people on the Forbes list of global billionaires. Its founder, Zhang Yuk, born in a poor village in 1968 during the Chinese Cultural Revolution, is now worth almost as much as Alibaba founder Jack Ma. China also hosts the fourth biggest battery manufacturer, Warren Buffett backed BYD. Competition for cattle outside China. Outside China, cattle faces tough competition from established players LG and Panasonic, respectively second and third on our ranking. With more than 100 years of history, Panasonic has Tesla and Toyota among its battery buyers. LG pouch cells are used in EVs from Jaguar, Audi, Porsche, Ford, and GM. U.S. and Europe's plans for battery production. President Joe Biden's strategy to make the United States a powerhouse in electric vehicles includes boosting domestic production of batteries. European countries are also looking to reduce decades of growing reliance on China. As Western countries speed up, new players are expected to rise. A host of next-generation battery technologies are already being developed by U. S. companies, including Ionic Materials, Quantumscape, Sela Nanotechnologies, Cyan Power, and Cyanic Energy. Any direction the market moves, certainly the forecast is bright for battery producers.